Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of some building Big Germ. How's everybody doing it today? Last episode, we moved out to this new area and started working on our new Japanese style. And I've been working on it a little bit more, the style. Uh, I've got some builds I've been practicing in my creative test world. But off camera, in between episodes, like I said, I've been working on it a little bit. I've also worked on the acacia texture, colors, um, and let's get rid of that real quick. And I've gotten, I've went out, I've gone out like 7,000 blocks uh, and got some pandas. And here they are. Uh, there's one here and one or two over there because I've bred them. Uh, but yeah, I'm very, very glad we have pandas out here because uh, I think it's going to add a lot to the area. Um, I'm going to be breeding them, obviously, quite a bit. But yeah, this is what we got going now. I've added in a few more of these Tory gates. Also, somebody pointed out that I needed to add a little middle thing in the in the middle. And uh, they were right. I looked up all my, or I looked up a bunch of reference images of Tory gates in real life, and they all had something in the middle there. So I added that. Uh, so thank you for pointing that out to me. Um, also, I've added another house over here, uh, and nothing too special about that one yet. But uh, we'll get some stuff going on in that later. Actually, there is something special about it. Uh, this is the same exact shape as the house we had out at the other the other jungle the green roofed one uh, But I just updated it to match our new style and new colors. I've also used the mushroom stem block here. I saw sausage using it uh, In his his builds. He's doing some Japanese style builds right now. I've missed a lot of his latest season uh, where he's working out in the Japanese area, so I, I just went back and started binge watching it and I noticed he used uh, That block in his builds quite a bit, so I thought I would give it a shot uh, But yeah, so the acacia wood is more orange now and it doesn't blend with whoops did I throw that out. Yes, I did It doesn't blend with spruce as well as it used to but I think overall Where's my acacia at? But I think overall it's a better change. And you know, it doesn't, it's not that bad together anymore. Uh, but it's more like if you were to mix these two in vanilla now. So, yeah. Uh, but I think uh, the color is better than it was. And more useful. Um, because sometimes if you were just looking at acacia on its own, a lot of times, I would think it was spruce. It was way too close to spruce, I think. Uh, but today, we are going to be working on... Well, we're going to be coming over here. Actually, can we breed, can we breed some pandas? Maybe in a little bit. Um, we're going to be coming over here. I've dug out a little bit of a hole here. A little bit of a hole in the wall. Because we are going to be building a little storage room, a little storage cave, actually, right in here. Uh, and we're going to dig this out way bigger, obviously. But, yeah, I thought that could be a pretty cool idea. Somebody suggested it to me, uh, and I thought it was a good idea. So I think we're going to do a little bridge across here. And then maybe, is this hill big enough, or should we just tear it down? I'm thinking maybe adding a little uh, a tunnel going through it. But, yeah, I think we might just tear the hill down. You know what, let me go ahead and clear off all the trees here. And we'll take a look at it once we have that done. Alright, we're back, and I've cleared off that little hill there. And I think I do want to try to uh, just make a tunnel through there, because I think we're going to do something on top of it that could be pretty cool. But, before we start working on that, I want to... I want to try to breed these pandas. So let's take down all of this. Uh, by the way, if you didn't know, I'm sure I'm sure most of you did know, but to breed pandas, you have to have bamboo actually placed on the ground around it. Uh, so that's interesting. Uh, but let's see if we can bring this guy all the way over here. All right, there we go. 
They're gonna do it. They're gonna breed. There we go. And unfortunately, it's all they've all been the same uh the same what do you call it? I forget what you call it. The same uh same personality. Um I was hoping I've been hoping that we would get some other personalities, but I don't know I don't know if you have to breed with different personalities for them to change or what. But I would think you should just be able to to just to just breed them and they would give out a different personality. But all right, let's head back over here now. And let's see if we can work out a little path through this uh this hill here. And maybe we should actually start on the other side for this. So let's go over here. And I want it to be pretty much straight across from here, so this is gonna be a good spot. Um, and let's just start digging. Let's just start digging through here. I think I want it to look fairly rough, like they did just dig through. Let's just dig through a, uh, a little cave here, or uh, just dig through the mountain here. Hardly any supports or anything like that. Uh, so yeah, I think it's gonna be a cool look. I want it to curve a little bit. So it lines up with the shore side over here near this pond. Okay, and we're here. All right, there we go. I think I think this is gonna be a good spot. Get me out of here. Uh, yeah, this is gonna work. This will be just fine. Get rid of some of this. And then obviously we'll have to fill this in. All right, there we go. Gotta put some uh, stairs and slabs in here obviously, but I think it's gonna be pretty good. I think this is gonna be a pretty good look. And I think we'll have, well, actually, I've been thinking about just covering up this lake here, so we may just have a road going straight over there. But I do wanna have some ponds around here, so I don't know. I may leave that, I'm not sure. But let's go ahead and head over here now. So I'm thinking we'll go down just a little bit. We may go down maybe like five more blocks uh, further than this. And then we're gonna carve out a big room for storage. And it sounds like we're gonna run into a cave here, so hopefully, hopefully we do, because that'll be a huge help. Uh, but all right, so I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna carve all this out, and uh, I'll be back once we get, the, get it all carved out, and we'll do some detailing together. All right, we're back. And I've been doing some work here, as you can see, uh, digging this out. I think I wanna expand it a little bit more this way. Um, but yeah, I think it's gonna be pretty good. It's not gonna be too massive. We're gonna have a bunch of different like branches to this area. Uh, this is gonna be more like my base for the area. We'll have we'll probably have like some farms down here that we can't uh, stuff we can't really turn into builds easily. Like I'm thinking we'll have a sugarcane farm down here probably, maybe a bamboo farm, but I don't know if we'll need really uh, a bamboo farm. Um, Let's see, get rid of that, boom, get rid of the dirt. I do wanna mix in some more blocks into the wall, like some andesite and uh, maybe some diorite or something, definitely some cobblestone. Uh, but for now, I just wanna do it all out of stone to get the basic shape first. Yeah, I think this is good. And we'll bring this back just a little bit more to give it a little more shape. Uh-huh. Just like that, that should be good. But okay, so we're gonna start out, and again, we'll probably change up some of this stuff uh, as we go, but I wanna start out by putting a wall of chest along the back here. So let's kinda cart this out a little bit. All right, so we're gonna craft a bunch of trap doors, and that should be plenty, and then a bunch of chests. Uh, let's just do all these. Boom, boom. That probably won't be enough, uh, but we'll see. And then I need some slabs to put up top. So we'll do we'll do half of that. Bring that across like that. There we go. And then bring this across like this. And this is going to be a little bit difficult to do. Oh, uh, maybe not. Before we do that, actually, we should bring this all the way across. 
Uh, so it looks like these are sitting on these and bring that to there and actually let's put that there and let's break these and put this here and we're gonna grab some of these acacia logs and put them up in the corners like that uh-huh and then here boom 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 like that and strip those of course yeah i think that'll look good and then bring these the rest of the way across and we need four more there we go one two three four uh oh okay we can do this we can do this one two three four there we go boom boom just like that that is good i think and then we're gonna come up uh, uh in the top here and just kind of try to mix in or try to blend it into the uh the ceiling here so do that oh we can't do that actually we have to do uh, i guess we could do stairs there just give me that and these are going to be pretty difficult to place actually how many do we need one two three four five six and let's see if we can do this let's carve this all out up top here all the way to there and then bring this all the way across just like that and then we can just fill this all in with stone yeah there we go we should be able to open these yes good uh and then we can just mix in some stone slabs to kind of blend it in a little bit better yeah that looks good and we'll put uh we can't actually there's a trap door there so yeah that's good and then I'm thinking, let's see, how do I want to do this? I think I want to get rid of that, actually, what we just did there. And we'll bring this up one more block, like that. Actually, I didn't need to do that, but we're going to bring this all the way across to there. Yeah, all the way across to there. And we'll put a stair there, a uh, trap door there whoops not there trap door there stair then a log in the middle here and then same pattern over here perfect all right there we go that's good i like that and let's see what else can we do here i do want to add some more depth to the ceiling here so let's do that real quick grab some slabs boom 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 now what i want to do uh, i want to have let's see let's think about this i want to have a uh, an entrance to a mine on one end and then an entrance for uh, future expansion on the other end let's go ahead and come outside here and take a look over here and see how much room we have okay looks like we have quite a bit of room going that way and we have quite a bit going that way as well so it doesn't really matter which way we go for that okay so i think we'll do the mine over here the mine entrance and we'll do we'll do two by three two wide by three tall man i'm hearing so many mobs give me a second i need to get rid of these guys oh okay here we go <laughs> uh that explains a lot it's a uh, a zombie spawner oh geez okay okay Okay, wow, there are so many zombies here. Let's get over here and light this thing up. All right, whoops, didn't mean to do that. All right, die. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez, okay. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're fine. There we go, that was easy. Ah, get out of here. Okay, some iron, some buckets, okay nice i did not know this was here and i'm glad i found out because i was driving me a little bit crazy you know one thing i really like about old jungles is uh they spawn with vines in the caves uh i don't think that happens in new jungles i'm not positive but i don't think that's a thing oh wow i never even noticed this uh cave was here okay let's hop back down here though but yeah, that's a really cool thing that uh, that older jungles have that I don't think new jungles do. 
But okay, so let's get back to this. Uh, I'm not gonna dig all the way down here today. I'll do that off camera. But yeah, I just wanna get this kind of started a little bit. All right, that should be good enough for now. Uh, but yeah, I think this is good. So I'm gonna go ahead and do some more detailing in here. I'll get the floor put in. I'll uh, probably add like some vines on the walls and stuff like that. Add in some different blocks into the walls. Uh, and I will be back with you in just a little bit once I have that done. All right, we're back and I've been doing a little bit of work here as you can see, adding in some details into the walls and adding in the floor and stuff like that. And I think it turned out pretty good. I like it. Pretty simple, but it's pretty good. I think it's good. Um, but now I got to move all this stuff over here into the chest, stuff like that. I'm probably going to uh, put another wall of chests on this side or a wall of barrels or something like that. Uh, just to get a little bit more space and maybe even line up some chests on the bottom there. But that stuff I'll do off camera. This is good for now though. But if we come out here, we still need to do a little bridge out here and then decorate this tunnel. Um, and I'm kind of thinking I want to do like a little Tory gate looking thing uh, for the entrance of this. I decorated it, made it look like a cave, but I think it could be cool. Maybe. You know what? No. We'll do that on the outside of this. The outside of this one. That's where we'll do the Tory gate thing. That will leave as a cave. But we do still need to do the bridge here. So let's see. Let's try to figure this thing out. Uh, let's start out. Let's get a bunch of slabs and a few stairs. Boom. And it's at a little bit of a weird angle. So let's see if we can try to make this feel right. That feels right coming out of here. Okay, that's good. Let's just get rid of that for now. Uh-huh. And then we'll want it to... Maybe we just do a full block here, actually. And then, like, full block here. Uh-huh. And a full block here. Do you that? Uh, maybe... Maybe this. Un upside down stair. And upside down stair. Yeah, that looks good. Then we'll have a block... Here, we'll just use slabs. Uh-huh. Slabs there. Um, yeah, I think this is gonna be good. Boom boom. Like this. Oops, get rid of that. And that. And then we'll start coming back down on this side. So we'll need to do uh how did we do this? We need to do an upside down stair here. And there. And then boom, boom. And I know that doesn't line up, but we can move. We can move this tunnel, no problem. Yeah, there we go. That's good. And actually, let's bring it out one more block. We'll do that, that, boom, boom. Upside down stair, upside down stair. And then like that. Yeah, that's good. Uh, and I think we'll replace it, actually. And you know what? I don't think I do want it to be cobblestone. I think I want it to be wood. Uh, and maybe a little bit of sandstone or something. So let me go ahead and grab that real quick. And let's see how this looks. So for now, let's just replace the middle blocks with uh, with wood. Like a so. Just like this. Uh-huh. Boom. And then here, here, and here. Yeah, that's good. And then maybe uh, let's grab some logs. Uh, boom, boom. Make these into the bark, bark blocks. And some fences, trap doors. And I think I'm going to go grab some sandstone too. Uh, but we'll see. Like that? Maybe? Maybe. I built a building in my uh, creative test world. And I made it almost completely out of acacia wood. Uh, and we'll probably be building that in the next episode, but I, I really, really like, I, I realized I really like building out of all acacia wood now. Uh, obviously mixing in some different colors, but I don't know. I really like this color. I don't know why. There's something about it that I really like. And get that and get that. There we go. And let's get rid of these. Uh, and maybe we'll put... 
Let's get rid of that. Fill that in. Do we do... What do we do here? I think we got to make it a little bit, uh, a little bit thicker. Let's do stair there, stair there, and stairs there. And then maybe, uh, well, let's get rid of this first. Slabs all along there, stair there, 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 and there. There we go. Get rid of these. Uh, and then maybe fences all along here. How does that look? Mm, a little strange. Yeah, a little strange. But you know what? I don't hate it. I don't hate that look. Uh, and then I'm thinking one more support in the very middle. Like that. And we'll just do that there. No, we won't. We'll do a full block there. Let's strip all those. Uh-huh. And then grab a full block. Boom. Let's see. How does this look? It's not terrible. And you know what? Let's do this. Let's do stairs all around it. Boom. 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 Building, building a diagonal bridge... Well, usually just building a diagonal bridge is already pretty difficult, but now we got to build it on this, like, such a small scale. It's pretty difficult to do. So I don't know if this is going to look great or not. I may, may end up tearing down this whole thing. Um, yeah, let's do this. Boom, boom. Maybe one more in the middle. One more log. Boom, boom. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I like that or not. It looks weird from here. It definitely looks weird. But I don't know if I hate it enough to redo it. Yeah, I don't... I One thing I definitely don't like about it is how big the railing is on the side. So let's get rid of that. We'll put slab there, slab there, there and there. Yeah, yeah, that'll work. And then, hmm. No, you know what? This is too wide, I think. I think what we started out with was better. Like this. Yeah, that's better. If we just do this, is that going to look weird? Is that going to look bad? Yeah, that doesn't look great. And honestly, oops, I'm not liking this in the middle. What if I do this? Full block here. Full block here. And then full block here and here. Uh, and then, well, how do we do this? Stare there, stare there. Yeah, that gives a little bit of depth. And you know what? Let's even do the middle one. Boom. And slab there, and slab there. Okay, yeah, the bottom side of that is looking better. And I might even slap... Might even slap a trap door in there, give it a little bit more of a curve there. Yeah, that's good. And then what do we do up top here? This is kind of difficult. Let's get rid of that. I want to see, can we do something like this? Um, this has got to be there. Then that, then that. We break these. Boom, boom. Um, hmm. Do I like that? I feel like I shouldn't. No, I don't like that. You know what? Maybe we don't even need a railing on this thing. Maybe it'll look better without a railing at all. So let's get rid of this. Das. Did I get it all? I think so. Oh, no, there's one. 
Yeah, I think without the railing at all, it looks best. Let's uh, let's step back and take a look at it, and then we'll walk over it. Yeah, I don't hate that. I don't hate that. I like it. I think I like it. And then walk it over it. Feels good. Yeah. Now, no, let's not make any more adjustments to it. Let's let's leave it at that. I like it. That's good. Now let's go ahead and let's try to build this Tory gate out front. And actually, let's go ahead and grab this and this. I don't think we'll need the uh, the stone cutter, but grab it just in case. And let's take this back a little bit. So I'm thinking, um, yeah, let's dig back a little bit more. I'm thinking, go there, not there, there, uh, 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 hang on, there we go, right there. Yeah, that'll be good. And we'll try to copy this one. Oh wait, no, this isn't, oh yeah, it is, this is the same width. We'll try to copy that one there. So we need to go up, well maybe, we'll make a few adjustments to this. Maybe we'll do the buttons here, and then we go up one, two, three, one, two, three, yeah, and then slab there, slab there, is that too low? No, I don't think so. Trap door, trap door, bring these across like that, boom, 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 bring that up, bring that up there, and this out there. Boom, boom, boom. Whoops, not that. There, okay. And then we'll bring this across like that, put a stair there, break that one, stair there. And then we do a trap door there, trap door there. And then the stair is out like this on the sides. Or slabs, not stairs, just like that. And full block there. And there we go, I think that should be good yeah yeah i like that that's good uh and then we'll decorate this out of course to make it look a little bit better so it's not just dirt behind this that would probably be stone make it look like an actual cave entrance uh yeah so let me go ahead and wrap this whole thing up real quick and we'll end off the episode there all right we're back and i've been doing a little bit of work here i got the uh cave entrance all figured out and right now i'm just doing a little bit of decorating not anything too crazy uh, but just adding some leaves around the place and some bone meal and i usually try to break all the double tall grass but i feel like uh, i'll probably break some of them but some of them i don't hate too much yeah this one's gonna go yeah i kind of like it kind of like it let's we got one more bone meal where are we gonna put it do right here Boom. Wow, that was a mistake. Okay, we got rid gotta get rid of all of these. Um, but, yeah, I've been doing a little bit of work here. And I think it's looking pretty good. Uh, we'll do boom, boom. Give me that, that there, boom. Give me that, put that there. Get rid of that, put that there. Okay. And we are good. Yeah, I like it. Uh, but yeah, we come through here. This is what the cave looks like. I need to do some texturing, but I ran out of andesite. Uh, so I'll do that later. And actually, let's pop some, well, hmm, maybe some there. Yeah, that's good. One there. Maybe one down there. Eh, okay. Yep, that's good. And, well, yeah, we're good. That's good. So this is what it looks like from this side. Again, I need to do some texturing. It looks uh, a little bit lacking uh, because we don't have any, and wait, no, don't have any andesite left really. Uh, so I needed to go collect some of that. And luckily we are, we're like right on the border of new terrain and old terrain. If I crank up my, well, actually that forest you see over there, with the birch trees over there. Oh, and that gravel right there, that's new terrain. 
So I can just go over there to collect some andesite. Um, if you don't know, uh, maybe I should show this. Well, maybe I'll show it later. Uh, we're almost done with the episode here, but I'll, I'll end it off by showing you where we are. See so yeah, how we come across this bridge and then we come down here into the cave, into the storage cave. So that's pretty cool. I like it. I like how this place turned out. But okay, let's go on a little trip. Just real quick, I want to show you all where we're at in the world. So let's grab our boat. And actually, I can't take the boat that way yet. So let's grab our elytra and our one rocket. And we'll see where this can get us. So that mountain range right over there. Um, is... Yeah, there's the path we were on the last episode. So right over here, this is... Uh oh This is that red kingdom. the With the red walls. I don't have a name for it yet. But yeah, there you go. You can see the castle right there. And then we fly back this way. And I don't know why my frame rate's so low right now. We fly, fly back this way into this kingdom. And we hop in a boat. So if we hop in a boat, go under the bridge we just made going this way, uh, away from the kingdom, the opposite direction of the other place we just saw. And we just keep following this river. You can see there's the wall uh, from the new terrain, like the chunk borders. You can see some trees cut off over there. That wall cut off, obviously, that hill. Uh, we just follow this river all the way into the taiga over there. And you see here's another chunk border right here. Uh, we come over here into this plains, which by the way, I've changed the plains color, uh, the plains biome color, grass color. Uh, so it's a little bit brighter now. Let's go ahead and sleep real quick. But yeah, we got a castle over there that you can see rendering in. That was a very old castle. I haven't been, I haven't built there in years. Uh, maybe we'll revisit that sometime in the future. Oh, we got that castle over there, and then right over there, right over through those trees, you can see one of the houses we're entering in right now. That is the White Falls Castle. And that, that travel there is all under, like, five minutes. You can see a bridge over here, which we need to redo at some point. Uh, at some point in the near future, I want to redo a lot of this, like, road through here will not redo it I want to do it uh, because I have it all marked out let's go ahead and wrap around here real quick so you can see where we're at yeah there's the castle of White Falls looking pretty good I like it a lot uh, but yeah come across this bridge here which I need to redo it looks pretty terrible it's in the uh, the old style I was talking about a little while ago and then got this what's supposed to be this road uh, on the edge of this cliff here, which would be, it'd be a pretty cool project to get done. Uh, but just haven't gotten it done yet. And then over here is actually my first house that I ever built in this world. It's made of spruce logs, spruce doors, and then a little cobblestone roof. And I was thinking, could be pretty cool to come back here and uh, actually like redo this and make it like a little hobbit hole or something. I don't know. Could be cool. Maybe. We'll see. Uh, yeah, let me know. Let me know if you think we should come back and redo this little thing. It's the very first thing I built in this world. Besides, like, other stuff that, I mean, just, like, blocking myself into a hole at night and then stuff like that. Uh, but, yeah. So that's actually going to do it for this episode. Um, it was a little bit of a weirder one, I feel like. Uh, but, I don't know. I enjoyed it. I've re I'm really enjoying working out in that in that area, the Japanese style. Uh, I've never done anything like that before, and it's it's very inspiring and refreshing to be doing a style that's new to me and I really enjoy. And uh, yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. So yeah, that's gonna do it for this episode. Hopefully you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Uh, let me know. Let me know what you think of all the all the things we got done today. If you have any suggestions for anything I should add to this place. Or just the kingdom in general. Let me know. Uh, suggestions for that little starter base too. That would be cool. 
uh, maybe get some ideas going for that. And uh, yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Also, make sure to hit subscribe if you haven't. I checked my analytics the other day and there's actually quite a few people watching that aren't subscribed. So make sure to hit subscribe. You probably didn't make it to the end, but oh well. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. I will see you all in the next... The, wait, that's going to do it for this one. I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.